justify your Halloween costume, but they can also cause some serious health concerns. New Channel 10's Nellie Ramirez joins us live in the studio to tell us the issues behind Halloween contact lenses. The biggest concern with Halloween contact lenses is most of them are labeled as one size fits all. Everyone's eyes are different, and if you are wearing contact lenses not fitted to your eyes, you can develop serious injuries within days and even within hours. It is an issue that we deal with every year. Um, with Halloween, people want to do something fun, cosmetic lenses, things like that, to change the appearance of the eye. The problem is it's usually last minute or they see them for sale somewhere where um, it's, it's not done by prescription. If you are looking for decorative contact lenses, make sure they are FDA approved. Contacts being sold at flea markets and even online may be illegal and harmful to your eyes. You can run into issues like bacterial infections, corneal ulcers. Uh, those can leave permanent scarring that can affect the vision long term. Then you run into other issues like uh, um, infections, um, not getting enough oxygen to the surface of the eye. So a lot of different issues that people don't really factor in when they're purchasing a lens just for fun. Thomas says a good rule of thumb is to plan ahead and order your cosmetic lenses through your doctor to avoid problems. Anyone who uses unfit Halloween contacts can be at risk, but doctors say teenagers may have a higher risk for eye problems. The biggest concern that we have is actually with uh, younger patients, um, teenagers or even younger, is actually sharing a contact lens. They'll have something that they want their friend to take a look at, try it on, see what it looks like on their eye, and you're basically sharing a, a medical device that's been on someone else's eye, and that's a great way to spread infection. If you plan to wear Halloween contact lenses, look out for irritation, redness in your eyes, and a change in your vision. If you have any of these symptoms, Dr. Thomas recommends you take off the contacts immediately and contact your optometrist. Reporting live from the studio, 